Today we're going to talk about the Maverick Tactic, which is the brand new head from Maverick, and it is definitely my favorite Maverick head to date, and I've liked them all. So let's get into it. Alright, so to start, the, uh, the face shape, I love the face shape. You know, it's not overly aggressive. It's got the, um, the beveled rails here that uh, will angle balls inward, like a 50-50 a ball on the sidewall. You know, it's, it's more likely to enter the scoop because of this beveled, this angle that's got um, guiding the ball inward. It's very similar to the, um, to the Jewel Aries head. You guys remember that one? That had, uh, it, actually that had a bigger, bigger bevel. Uh, and they had a percentage of 50-50 of balls. But if you, so if you drop a ball on the rail here, it's more likely to fall into the head than out of the head because of this, this beveled edge, which I love. I think that's a good idea. It's a very simple thing to do. As far as I know, I've never made a head. So the overall look and feel of this head, it's, it's very nice. The, um, the embossed tactic here is kind of cool. It's like part, part of it is, is sticking out. Part of it is, is sticking in. What do you call that? Embossed and I don't know. So the top half, sticks out, the bottom half goes into the head, which is very cool. Obviously that doesn't affect performance at all. As always, these are made in the USA. The scoop, the center of the scoop where you would dye a logo is that um, kind of brushed plastic, not totally high gloss, uh, but takes dye real well. Um, holds stickers real well. It's not overly textured. I mean, it's, it's a little bit textured, but it's not too textured that it wouldn't take stickers. Then underneath, well, in between the, the three holes here and the three holes here, there's some kind of diamond texture, which is cool. I don't know the function, but it looks cool. The sidewalls, the struts are different than previous Maverick heads in that they, they add stiffness because they're sort of crisscrossed. So it's almost like there's two struts, one going up, one going down, and they kind of exchange places. Um, I don't know how, how, they're, how to explain that really, but they're sort of reinforced the way they've done it with sort of a... I mean, it looks like it's two struts crisscrossing each other. They uh, are designed apparently to um, reduce stress and distribute stress to the opposite rail, which I think is pretty cool. You know, for, so maybe Kind of like how the CEO is is a stiff head, but it's a great face-off head. So this may be really good for face-offs, especially if it's if it's designed to withstand stress really well and it can distribute the stress really well. It may not warp. Um, that's just a theory. I you know I don't know. I'm sure they know when they designed it. It's a stiff head. It's it's nice and stiff. Very very solid head, and it doesn't look like it would be really to me. But it is absolutely a stiff head. Uh, the the weight I didn't I didn't weigh it before I strung it, but I think I read somewhere it's around five ounces. Uh, you know, so it's not it's not any heavier with the increased stiffness, but it's also got more uh, more cut away, less material. Like especially in the throat, if you compare it to other Maverick heads, you know, there's a lot more material missing all around the Maverick badge. Um, you can see, you can see through a lot more than you used to, or with other Maverick heads. So obviously, they're you know they've they've reduced weight that way without decreasing rigidity or stiffness. I guess that's the same thing, isn't it? Rigidity. I hate saying that word. Rigidity. I think that's how you say it. So it's you know it's stiff. It's it's light. It's uh, I love the face shape. It's easy to string. You know the top holes are big enough for leathers easily. Bottom holes are big enough for leathers. Um, the sidewall holes are, they're like a, a square. What's an angled square? A trapezoid? Mm. 
but uh, they're big enough, you know, especially the top holes are bigger. They're, they're big enough for, I did two, you know, wrapped it around twice, but I think you could get three in there with pliers. It's kind of designed for a mid pocket. And I, I definitely gave it a mid pocket with this string job. Um, it shifts high, but you know, it's, it's designed for mid and I thought I'd go with that and, uh, you know, but you could easily, you could string a mid high, you know, it's, it's, you could string anything in it, but I'm, you know, it's definitely not designed for low, as you can see from the, from the angle, the curvature, um, high, you know, it, it's designed for a mid pocket, uh, but mid high will work. No, no question. High will even work, but it's a, it's a great head. I'm a huge fan of this head. I don't know what it's going to retail for, probably around a hundred. If you plan on dying Maverick heads, you have to, uh, you have to be careful here. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see, but inside, you see the, the three holes that kind of help anchor the badge? That can, die can bleed through there. So it's best to pop this off, fill the, fill the holes with whatever, however you're masking. Because that's a bummer, you know, if you're doing something intricate down here and you get some bleed somewhere, you know, because you didn't know there were holes under the badge. Uh, nice ball stop. Uh, good looking, good looking head altogether. Yeah, Tanner, come in. I'm just gonna open the garage door. I'm scared. I got my sheets. Turn my sheet. You have Premier, right? Premier, yeah. Is it cool if I try to learn that? Yeah, but I'm. You can't have it for like all day. I know. Actually, yeah, I'll just do it. Really All right, see ya. All right. So uh, overall, I mean, this is a this is a great offering from Maverick. So you know, every head they've come out with, they've they've improved upon, and you know, they just keep getting better and better. This is strung with uh, with Red Star V2 mesh, and it's dyed yellow and like Carolina and uh, braided top string, yellow shooter, Carolina throat string, Carolina, oh no, whites, no, Carolina sidewalls and top string. And it's, uh, it came out really nice. And my younger son saw this head and he's like, oh, that's sick. Can I use it? I was like, sure. He's like, can we take out that mesh and put white in? I'm like, yep, we can. So this won't be around too long like this. So anyway, guys, definitely, you know, if you're in the market for a new head, you want a high performance head, you want to top of the line, you know, head that obviously is a lot of R&D goes into these. So I, I, lacrosse heads are made out of um, like a nylon polymer, which is why you can't, you can dye heads, lacrosse heads, but you can't dye fiddlesticks because those are just plastic. Plastic doesn't really dye. Where a nylon polymer takes dye really well. This is something they call Duratuff, and apparently it increases the stiffness and provides consistency in all weather conditions. Um, you know, so I'm, I'm probably like the uh, the ACP, the STX, was it STX? The ACP, the all weather, all climate, whatever. So, you know, it, it can freeze, it can get hot, and it's gonna be consistent. But yeah, it's, I'm a fan of this head. It's, it's a good, it's a good piece of equipment. So nice job, Maverick. Uh, I really like Maverick. I think it's they're one of my one of my favorite companies out there. So I was excited when they when they offered to send this to me to check out. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Maverick Tactic, go check it out if you're looking for a head. This is a nice one. All right, see you.